Yo, what is up guys? Delboy here. So since Manny Pacquiao defeated Keith Thurman, I have seen a lot of, I guess, detractors label Manny Pacquiao a drug cheat. Now, I've got to say, I'm not here to discuss whether Manny Pacquiao is or isn't on PEDs. As far as I'm concerned, most of these pro fighters are very suspect. And ultimately, I believe most of these top-level athletes are on something. Now, that's just how I feel. If you disagree, you disagree. If you agree, you agree. It is what it is. But it's been the topic of conversation in the build-up and aftermath to Keith Furman versus Manny Pacquiao. Now, as was widely reported, there was no VADA testing for Keith Furman versus Manny Pacquiao. Now, first and foremost... For me, it's a non-starter anyway, because ultimately, it was a level playing field. Both guys were expected to meet the same standards. Both guys knew there was no VADA testing involved, and everybody knew what the deal was. It was a totally even playing field, as far as I'm concerned. There was no weaponized drug testing, and we'll get into that topic in another video. There was no one fighter dictating how the drug testing should go. Both guys knew what they had to do. Both guys knew what was expected of them. And it was a fair playing field. You know, people are saying, well, Manny Pacquiao was on PEDs. Maybe Keith Furman was. I mean, ultimately, it's not like this is the first fight of Keith Furman's with the PBC that he's not been, you know, under VADA testing. His fight with Danny Garcia... No VADA testing. Where was the outcry then? Where was it? There was none. When Keith Furman beat Danny Garcia, there was no, oh, this guy was obviously on steroids or PEDs. None of that. But when Manny Pacquiao beats Keith Furman, in the exact same situation, all of these guys accuse the dude of being on PEDs and try to discredit the win. But these guys didn't hold Keith Furman to the same standard when his situation with Danny Garcia was the exact same. Now, why is that? You guys can tell me, but ultimately, as far as I'm concerned, this was a level playing field. As far as I'm concerned, no drug testing is better than weaponized drug testing. And I will make a video on weaponized drug testing in the near future. But as far as I'm concerned, a level playing field is always desirable, whether that involves drug testing or not. No fighter should be able to dictate what drug testing agency is testing in a certain fight. For me, you know, when it comes to world level boxing, there should be one organisation, one procedure, one standard, one organisation, and that is it. Anything other than that is counterproductive and, in my opinion, not good for the sport. A level playing field is always better. So until these guys are held to the same standards, you are really not going to hear me push drug testing like that. What do you want me to say? Look at Billy Joe Saunders, for example. UCAD said this guy was not guilty of violating any rules, but Varda, or Wada, said he was. Until these guys are all on the same page, until they all adhere to the same standards, drug testing is pointless. When you have fighters dictating what agency is used, drug testing is pointless. It is what it is. And, you know, all of these dudes pushing VADA, I mean, look at Floyd. That dude never underwent a VADA test in his career. You never held him to that standard. You know, drug testing, like I said, weaponized drug testing isn't good for the sport, as far as I'm concerned, until there is one universal standard, drug testing is pretty much pointless, in my opinion. And listen, I don't think we'll ever get to that stage where we have one universal standard. But one thing I will say... You know, we as boxing fans, if we are going to take drug testing seriously, I mean, me personally, like I said, I'm not that bothered right now. 
But you guys who do, at least hold these guys to the same standard, for Christ's sake. At least hold these guys to the same standard as each other. But, you know, I doubt that will happen. Share your thoughts below. Peace.